it's not like there's one neighborhood that's the low-income neighborhood, you know, the, the one side of the tracks or whatever. There's pockets of poverty all over our city. Every now and then, you cry yourself to sleep and think that you're a failure. People are proud. Some of the folks that access my food pantry are people who have donated to our food pantry in the past. I work really hard. I work a lot of hours. I'm smart. I'm educated. It felt pretty awful. I think a lot of parents, their anxiety is, if I say something, will I be in trouble? You know, if I admit that I'm having a hard time making ends meet and getting food, is that going to tip off the school that, you know, then they're going to call CPS or something just because I've said this. And that's not really the case. I mean, we want to, that's why we have this program, so that we can say, look at, we've got these resources. I can't let my little girl go hungry. I won't let my little girl go hungry, even if it means swallowing my pride. I went to bed hungry multiple occasions, but my kids didn't. I think as parents, that's what we do. A lot of times kids learn some coping skills at a very young age, you know, where, where there may be needs that I don't, none of us are readily aware of in the school because people are coping so well, you know, they can cover it. I refer to the food bank as my friend. It's kind of like a silent partner in my life. The food bank's always there and doesn't give us any grief about needing any help. It feels a basic need that kids and, and families have. And if you can have those basic needs met, you can come to school ready to learn. The strongest people are the ones that ask for help. It's the weak ones that think that they can do it on their own. You have to be strong enough to ask for it. Without the donations um, and the great people who help distribute them, there'd be a lot of hungry people here. I'm really grateful that my daughter doesn't have to go hungry. The food bank does a great job. The problem is they can only give us stuff when they have stuff, you know. And there are times when our delivery might be a little bit smaller because that's all that they had to kind of ration out to the different school pantries. There are a million ways to give to the food bank, a million ways to give. You can give fresh fruits and vegetables, you can give money, you can give your time, you can give your energy and effort. Um, there's a million ways to do good by working at the food bank and it helps a lot of people, a lot of people.